Right, why was it important to you guys to make this film this year? This year is the 100th anniversary of the Armenian Genocide, and it's important for us uh, as Armenians and as filmmakers um, to be able to present to the public a film that we think um, embodies uh, our pain, but also our demands relating to 1915. Now, this is your first film. Was it challenging to, to pick such a passion project as your first film? It's not challenging to pick the project. Pro to pick the project, it's challenging to execute it with the uh, with the honor and the quality and the beauty that it deserves and the truth that it deserves. And tell me about the cast and how did you go about picking the cast? Well, we wrote the lead roles for Simon Apkarian and Angela Sarafian, uh, and they were kind enough to agree to play those roles. So it was a filmmaker's dream come true and an international cast, a powerful cast of Sam Page and Nikolai Kins Kinski and Jim Piddick and Deborah Christofferson and many others joined uh, to tell this very important story. So we're very blessed to have a, a, a complete and beautiful and in international cast. And you worked with Serge Tankian from System of a Down. He was the composer of the film. What was it like working with him? Well, it was, it was great to have someone who, from the very beginning of the project, completely understood the complex and difficult story we're trying to tell and the important story we're trying to tell because it it lives in his blood as much as it does in ours and in his creative blood um, it's sort of the type of thing he's been he's been after his entire career even though the, the music in the film is very different from what you're used to hearing from Serge Tankian so it was it was meant to be it was a blessing and he's done a great job providing the musical world in, in of 1915 what personal experiences in your own lives helped inspire this film? Well, we all have personal experiences. That's what the point is. Uh, the point of this movie is. This isn't a work of fiction. So I mean, did you grow up hearing stories about it, and did something specific, specifically trigger that? And it's interesting for Alec and me. The answer is different, and yet kind of the same. Which is that this trauma, this common trauma, which happened in 1915, the destruction of our people and homeland, has been transmitted down the generations in very different ways. Um, that's what our movie's trying to explore. It's not so much about politics, and it's not really about history. Uh, it's about the psychology uh, that lingers. It's about how the unrecognized ghosts of 1915 continue to haunt us uh, to the present day. So it's really the, the, unspecific, the unspecific ways in which this story lives and in which 1915 lives in us and in the people around us that made us want to tell, make this movie. Tell us a little bit about your process from pre-production to post-production. We approached the movie in a very, in hindsight, in a very innocent way. We believed that if we, if we put in our time, and if we did things with the uh, justice and the creativity that our movie deserved, then things would fall into place. And Simon Abkarian fell into place. Angela Sarafian fell into place. Serge Tankian fell into place. We were blessed to have a beautiful team, a great producer, uh, and together we embarked on this journey. And it's a journey that has brought us here today to the Egyptian Theater. And what do you hope people will walk away with? We hope they walk away with our story breathing in, in their hearts and in their minds. And we hope they walk away with something that they won't forget for a long time and we hope ever.